it's an uh, intelligent human life and all these robot dogs that are happening. Is that no problem in that as long as the haram is to have a robot that looks like a human being or a, 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 a creature, you know, an, am, an animal with a head, and this is a statue. Other than that, AI is just doing what you're telling it to do. So you want it to draw a portrait or to make a, a sonnet or a song, it can do that. But you're the one who's feeding it with the data or telling it and showing it the pathway to collect the information and compose whatever you want it to do. If you use it for halal things, that's But what? the recent agents, multi agents, and the fact that the Googles and the they're talking about the 10,000 PhDs in a team and being able to invent themselves. Nah, this is bogus. Nothing invents itself. It's Allah, the creator. Yeah, I mean, so we believe that no, they failed to manufacture a single eye, one eye. They have cameras, they have this, they have that. They cannot duplicate a human eye. This is only by the creator. No one on in this universe ever claimed to create it. This is Tawheed al rububiyyah Allah is al-Khaliq. No one ever claimed to be able to create anything. And how many eyes do we have on earth? 14 billion existing eyes manufactured by Allah Azza wa Jal. And how many eyes are being in the process in women's wombs? Like two, three billions. And how many eyes of animals, fish, birds, insects? Trillions and gazillions. So no matter what they claim, it's all bogus. I mean, looking at the end of the day, just one last statement. Um, like Jeffrey uh, Hinton, the Nobel Peace Prize person that won, uh, known as the godfather of AI, he's predicting 50% of annihilation of the human race. Yeah, yeah. Well, we have the Terminator to come and <laughs> fix things. This is the same concept of the Terminator. Yeah, yeah. And then the, the, the company that was doing this, and yeah. they focus. They can't even protect themselves from missiles coming from Hezbollah. Where is your AI annihilating my foot? And this is all to scare people, to intimidate people. He, we have Aqidah. And we know what humans are capable of and what Allah Azza wa Jal is capable of. And this is why Umar al-Mukhtar of Libya, when he was fighting off the Italians, the invaders, and they said they're coming up with their fighter jets and they throw bombs. He said, who's above? The fighter jets or Allah? They said, Allah. We know who's gonna prevail. Simple as that. This is tawakkul. This is having belief in Allah Azza wa Jal and not being and, and he's a kafir, he's a disbeliever. Would I believe him? He says 50%. Even if he says 5%, I would not believe him. He's, he does not have the credibility. Being the former uh, CEO of Google or whatever, or the godfather of AI or the likes, doesn't have any credibility on whatsoever. And we have the future to prove us wrong. We have no problem in admitting, we, but logically, uh, uh, rationally, Practically, all of this is nonsense.